students learn how to how to use ChatGPT for uh, Visual Studio Code. Here, from uh, the extension icon, just search for Chat GPT four, and here uh, this is uh, this extension uh, by Easy Code AI. We will uh, download this, install this. Uh, it, uh, no account uh, need, so we can use it uh, in the team once uh, it is uh, installed. And you can see uh, this icon uh, appear to here. We can use it. And let's apply without account. Here, let's uh, decide what we want. For example, uh, write uh, Python code uh, for uh, computing. The factory, for example, and let's type ask for this. As you can see, uh, uh, it uh, generated the code here. Uh, here is the license code for computing the factory, for example. And let's let's copy this. Uh, once you uh, click on it, uh, the code will be copied to the clipboard. Clipboard. Uh, let's create uh, a new file, like a file. Uh, let's save it first. And test it and save. And let's save it. Uh, as you can see, you can see also uh, it, uh, it provides uh, uh, an explanation for uh, the code uh, uh, it generated. Uh, here's the explanation for the factorial. It defines a function called factorial that takes a single argument in and so on. So you can use it in your daily uh, work and daily coding. Um, and let's run this code in here. And as you can see, but uh, this is a function. Uh, uh, 